Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I will show you guys how to install WADS onto your Nintendo Wii using the Wii Mod Lite WAD Manager. So the first thing you will need to do is just go ahead and take out your Wii's SD card. You must have a homebrewed Nintendo Wii to be able to do this. If you get your SD card, go and connect this to your PC and I will show you guys what to do next. So I will leave a link to the GitHub to get Wii Mod Lite in the description of this video. And this is actually the latest um, Wii kind of like WAD manager you can get. I mean, it was updated in 2016, but it's still kind of new considering this is for the Nintendo Wii. So all you guys want to do is download these two files, um, the Wii Mod Lite zip file and then the forwarder file. The forwarder zip file, just make sure you can install um, this kind of application to your Wii's home screen. So once we've downloaded those two files, you want to go to your downloads folder. Now I've also got a WAD in here, it's entirely up to you where you get your RADs from. Obviously the Wii shop has now closed. Um, I've just got Pac-Man and um, this is a NES virtual console game. And you must get a WAD which um, matches your Wii's um, region. So my Wii is a Europe PAL Wii, so I've got a Europe WAD. What we're going to do is find our Wii's SD card, we are going to drag and drop the WAD into the WADS folder. If you don't already have one, you can create one. Just right click, new folder, call it WADS. Next, we need to get these two files and select right click and extract here. So we can also um, go into this WAD file and we need to copy across these two files into the WADS folder. Now once you've copied them across, V Wii is for the Wii U and normal Wii is just for the Wii. So mine is just a normal Wii, not a Wii U, so I'm just going to delete this file. Now back to our downloads folder, we just need to copy across the apps folder. So we can just drag and drop this, you should already have one, and we can just copy that across. So that is literally it for the PC, we've now set up our SD card with the correct files. So let's go back onto our Wii, uh, install these things, and I'll show you how it works. Back on the Wii, we just want to put the SD card back in and then just go and power it on. Okay guys, so on your way, the first thing we want to do is just go and open up the Homebrew channel. From there, we will be able to find the app. So here it is, Wii Mod Lite. We're just gonna press A and then scroll over to load and press A just to load it up. Okay, so what we're going to do is scroll down to WAD Manager and just press on A. And make sure you choose your SD card and then just press A. We are going to scroll down to the WADS folder and then press A to open it. And here is our Pac-Man WAD. So first of all, we can actually install the um, forwarder. So what this does is puts it on our home screen. So let's press on A to install this one. A for select. Now it's just going to start installing. Um, they shouldn't take too long. So it's now says press any key to continue. And we're gonna do the same thing for Pac-Man. So press A, A to install. Give it a couple of seconds. I think games might take a bit longer. And then once it's done, press any key. And now what we can do is press B to go back. Uh, keep on pressing B. And now once we're back at the main menu, we can actually just press um, the home button to exit. So now we can exit out the homebrew channel, press the home button and go to exit to system menu. And now we should have the game and the kind of like menu on our home screen. So here you go, you guys can see them on there. Here is Wii Mod Lite, so we can just open this when we want to go back into it. And then we've also got our Pac-Man game here, um, our kind of like WAD. So what we're gonna do, I'll just start this up and show you guys some quick gameplay. So here it is, just the Pac-Man WAD running. Now there's so many different WADs you can get. Um, as I said before, it's entirely up to you where you actually decide to get them from. So um, this would have been something that you would have been able to buy off the store. And um, yeah, you can install them using this really simple program. So that is pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one.